God damn it. Nah, I'm not going to say my opinions. I'm not going to say my opinions. I have my opinions, but I'm not going to say it. I cannot, cannot talk about a sexist guy. There you go. That's your opinion right there. <laughs> yeah, I cannot talk about a sexist guy. Hey, what up, guys? This is the last episode of the season. Episode 10 of the Artcast yes, Podcast. I'm here with Diddy Mark, the best co-host ever. That's the intro. Yes, sir. Bam. That's the intro, boom. But dude, I'm so tired of reading. I'm so tired of reading. I love dude. Diddy Mark. His art's not the best, but he's really inspiring. I have read that shit like eight times. Like the oh, last man. Oh, that's I'm those so are the tired. worst. Those are the worst shit. You know what I mean? You don't you, you never who says that shit? Nobody says that shit to you. You're no, bro, you're I get I uh, yeah, but I get I get some comments that are like, yeah, um nah, that's his, his art is his 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 kind of boring, but I like his art, you know. Those people, man. But I like, mean, I I agree. I agree. I'm I'm a boring person, but that's what yeah. I'm saying. Like the the most painful, the most painful uh, hate comments are the ones that you kind of agree with. So when people say he's kind of yeah. like my art's kind of mid, but he's entertaining, it's like damn, that kind of hurts because I I kind of believe that's true too. Like people aren't subscribed. Yeah. Like people aren't like, following me because they actually like my art. They like my YouTube channel and shit. And it just <laughs> makes me sad. That makes me sad a little bit. But I've been doing a lot of doing a lot of self reflection. I've been talking to uh, Leah a lot, Carbon Fiber. We we talk like oh. talk. And we've That's talked awesome. a fuck ton. I think for like like the last three nights, we just talk and she's basically just free therapy, man. Just bouncing like my ideas <laughs> off her crush. That that chick is wise, man. That, when I say she's like me, that's low key flex, honestly. I'm yeah, basically she, calling she, myself wise. She she, she 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 always responds like within a, within ten minutes or thirty minutes. Yeah, she she's yeah, she's always on her phone she, or, or she, she, she's she's helped me too. Like she's 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 gonna help me with some like when I do character designs, I'm, I'm like I'm gonna DM her to just to see if I'm doing something right. By the way, she um, will since, me, dude. She since yesterday, yeah, no. Since yesterday, podcast when mm-hmm. I draw, like right yeah. now, I I feel self conscious with my like with how I draw force with my designs and shit because like yeah. Um, since since Lee uh, follows my my shit, mm-hmm. I know that she has her eyes on my sh- on my drawings. Bro, so I'm like, let, oh, me, let me give you let me give you advice. I've spoken to Leah for a total of like maybe I want to say like twenty hours now. We we talk on bro. We talk on Discord a lot. Like we both be drawing on for hours, so I've spoken to her a lot. And that's, I, let that's me give you advice. Yeah, let me give let me give you advice. She doesn't like like she doesn't like art. She can respect it, but like she like completely has different tastes from us. To give you an example, she doesn't think Yusuke Murata is good. Like she doesn't like Murata. You know that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. She, she's, taste, she's she said yeah. a lot of stuff to me too. Like um, it's, her, she, it's just her taste. Like she doesn't. Yeah, like exactly. When she likes good. something, she won't like something that's not similar to that. You know. Yeah. Exactly. Like, exactly. She, she really loves like specific stuff in a specific art style. She cannot yeah. like one art style. She only likes a part of it, or even like just a small part. Yeah. Yeah. Um, like when I when I was trying to like pretty, pretty much like force her to compliment F- Fujimoto because I was telling her how much I love Fujimoto. She was like, so, yeah. she was saying so much. Ew, ew, ew. But she was like, well, I like the way he draws action. Like, she, she won't, she, she'll hate the art, but she like, like, one thing about it. So yeah, like, yeah. She, like, she's very so like, critical, but she still appreciate yeah. the art. Yeah, like, she, she I don't, I'm, I'm not going to ask her, but I don't think she likes my art. Like, she doesn't, she can respect that I'm an artist and, like, she, I think <laughs> she thinks I'm a good one, but she you doesn't, know, like, um, like it, you know what I mean? Bro, she hates web, that I, that I write shonen and my style is very anime-esque. But yeah, that's yeah. fine because uh, I mean that's my that's my uh, go-to, you know, when I draw. I prefer yeah. s- um, simpler Fujimoto like style, like you know. Yeah, that's shoulder, why I'm not. That's... I'm not gonna like apologize for like drawing the way. I, like even though she doesn't like it, I'm like, I mean, I respect it, but I'm not gonna change yeah. it. She like she likes that, and basically the reason I brought her up in the first place was because I've been talking to her a lot, and I'm just like, and I was telling you, I kind of told you too. I, bro, I think I'm fine not being the good artist, man. I think I'm I'm cool with it because. I'm really inspired by Fujimoto, like lately, honestly, way more than Murata. Like, I think Fujimoto is my guy now, to be honest. I love Murata, but I think Fujimoto yeah. is my guy now because what Fujimoto has done is like with relatively, I'm this is like an air quote, air quote, bad art. He's going to go down as one of the greatest in history right next to like Toriyama. Like, and I would say he, he he's going to do that over Murata. Like Murata is a goat because of his art, but Fujimoto is going to go down as like the greatest, like overall next to like. Akira Toriyama, even and Akira Toriyama is another example of someone who's not like does not have like amazing god tier art or like it's pretty simple. And I think yeah. maybe I'm maybe I'm just one of those guys. I'm not you. I'm not um someone I'm like not Kuro. you. 
people that's, would say like, oh, you know? no, like I'm saying like you're a, like you're good. Your art's like really detailed and like like this. It's just very aesthetically pleasing. I'm like people like my art. I can draw action well. I've gotten good compliments about the way I draw action. It's like you can tell what's going on and on, I can make your jaw drop at certain panels. But overall, like I'm not a like you know like a really good artist. It's, I know I don't suck. Look at me. I'm not shitting on myself. But like mm. people like you, Coterie Inc. You know you know what that is, right? I, the, the I artist, think so, yeah. The, the dude who draws like a, a ch- the the monkey. The, the monkey? Yeah, 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 yeah. That guy, uh, Murata. These people that like their art's just like actually fucking good. Like like the yeah, art yeah. catches your attention before anything. I'm not like y'all, bro. And you see what I mean when you read RR. Like I think that's yeah. The no, I feel it. I feel it. Like it's funny because um, seeing you in different types of art in a story, like you mm-hmm. discovered uh, an insane art, and you were like, I'm gonna like you skip one that is gonna be the best forever. And yeah, then yeah. you discovered like a great writer. You're like. Fujimoto is like the best, like overall. Yeah. I just can't yeah. wait. I just can't <laughs> wait for someone to inspire you as much as those two to say that, yeah. oh, this artist is my current favorite. Because that's that mm. that it's amazing because that that happens to me uh, a bunch of times last year. I mean, I mean for the past three years. Like Kuzumari, I was like, oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna binge draw like his style for like mm. for forever. And then I yeah. discover like Ichiro, I mean not Ichiro, but uh uh, Yusuke Morata, for example, or Vagabond, you know, Boichi. Uh, yeah. And now I just I just like Fujimoto like you because Fujimoto is, is so, like, God here, he's like, so, in writing. Yeah, he's so well-rounded. Yeah, even though, even though his art's not, like, amazing, like Morata or some shit, it's yeah. still, it can still, like, you can still hold up his work next to Morata's work and it'll, like, be, there'll be equals, you know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I was, yeah, yeah I'm, because even if it's not as amazing as, okay, I think... We're saying it's not as amazing. It's it's more of a it's not as detailed as Murad. I think I think Fujimoto can do it. He just chose not to because I think he I, focuses I more. Mm-hmm. On, I don't uh, know if on Fujimoto stories. could do it. I don't know if he could, but I think but like based on what we've seen, Murad is like objective. Well, um, like art is not okay, objective. Yeah. But yes, Murata is okay. objectively a better artist. Like fundamental. Like but Fujimoto, there's something more like very. The reason why I, I really like his art right now is because like social media like really fucks with me. And like, mm-hmm. what I really want to get good at is not giving a fuck, and that's the vibe I get from reading Chainsaw Man or like Tatsuki Fujimoto or anything. There's just this like aura in his work of like, I don't give a fuck. I'm just doing this shit because it's fun. That's how his work always feels to me, and that's what I want to. Uh, that's what I want to do. And when I talk yeah. to Leah and shit, she's like, she's like, kind of helping me and encouraging me to like kind of be more like that. And so essentially, she's like, you should like be like Murata in the sense that if you want to do it, like if you just feel like doing something, just fucking do it. Because that's what he does. This man had the most popular manga in the world, but he was like, nah, I feel like drawing like 300 one shots and just said, fuck off. I have to go do that shit. And like, was was like W's, you know what I mean? And that's looking why I did RR. Like I should have focused on Metal Souls, but I'm like, nah, I'm trying to be like, I'm trying to be like uh, Tatsuki Fujimoto. I feel like doing this. I'm going to fucking do it. I'm already writing uh, the chapter two for RR because God, people love that shit, man. On my Patreon, it got a lot of fucking comments. I'm already writing the chapter two for RR. And I'm, I think I want to make an, a one shot for fun too. I just, I just want to, I, I have this feeling of, I want to just, I want to just not give a fuck anymore. Like I, I don't give a shit about like artists to be honest. With you. I don't, I don't care about artists anymore. Like I can recognize and I can respect mm-hmm. the good, artists, like on social media and shit, mm-hmm. but I'm not like a fan. I don't, I don't really care about you anymore. You know, like you're just, you're just a person to me. And that's one thing that I'm trying to steal from Leah. She does not like anybody. She doesn't give a fuck, you know? Yeah. Yeah, well, I get that. I'm just not that extreme, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I just, I'm just tired of like trying to impress people. I'm just trying to just have fun. That's what I want to do. Just yeah, have for fun. Sure. And I think that's best for my mental health because I don't really think when I'm drawing or whatever I post, I don't really care what people think or if there's like this really cool artist that follows me. You know, I'll just instead of like worrying about what they're going to think or would they, would they, you know, follow me because they'll see our trash. I'm just, I just don't care. Yeah, and that's I remember. <laughs> This is like a deja vu shit because I remember you telling me that same shit last like last month. Yeah, yeah, but this time I this time I mean it. This time I mean <laughs> you it. said this, you said the same thing too. This time <laughs> I mean it. But but I'm still on the same I'm still on the same vibe. I'm just, I guess I'm yeah, getting yeah, better no, at no, it. I, I understand, understand. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm again like um thinking of I think if you think it like uh, as a game like you know the like learning something it's obvious that Yusuke Murata focused on art 
uh, so much. Like he he maxed that shit out on on his like stats. Yeah, Fujimoto, yeah. you you'll see that he improves everything at the same time. That's why um, his art style is not as you know. I mean his art skill is not as um, good. good. That's not like he's, he's less. Oh, he's no, I get it. He's good. He's less experienced. But- yeah, yeah. Like, for example, God, this is you. You're gonna disagree, but you can suck my dick because it's true. Fuck you. Um, your art is more. Your, chill out. Your your art is way more is more detailed than Fujimoto's. Uh, Do you disagree? You, yeah, you can't. You can't okay. disagree. You dick. You can't. Okay, yes, yes, because I do illustrations and he does manga pages. If I no did motherfucker, a manga... if you if you did a, if you if you did a manga and I'm like, but when I'm thinking about your manga style, I'm thinking of what you did with White Ashura. That was like artistically. A lot of people White would Ashura. say, you know, "Oh, bro, it's yeah. the, oh no, no, I'm oh. dead ass, I'm dead ass <laughs> bro, like, my brain, you just opened something in my brain." <laughs> yeah, dead ass. A lot of people would say, no, a lot of people would no say that. No one fucking remembers that. Yes, yeah, someone who doesn't know who Fujimoto is, like if they're not like kind of blinded by how good his stories are, like if they've never read anything Fujimoto, if you like, you show them, oh, look at his art and look at like your art and White Ashura. A lot of people would say yours is better, and I'm not saying that you're better than Fujimoto, but like. They, like I think Fujimoto is so good, like he's so well rounded. Because personally, for me, and this is my opinion, I don't think he's really trying to like really impress people. I think he's he's kind of doing his thing. He's just kind of telling his story. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. And Gege Akutami does the same shit too. Like he doesn't give a fuck about Ichiro Oda too. Ichiro yeah, yeah, stopped giving. I, yeah, I think since yeah. the beginning doesn't just give a fuck. And I, and more than and now more than ever, I'm more obsessed with that than. Uh, good art. I'm more obsessed with like kind of just being so like free and not really giving a shit. I'm kind of just doing shit for me, you know. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But uh, oh, yeah, man. I'm on my Fujiboro shit. Uh, hopefully, it's not a phase. I kind of like this. I wanna, I wanna stay it on. It would this. be a phase. Uh, we change. We people, people change. You know, especially. Yeah, but I don't want to. I don't want it to be a phase. It's like if. I feel so like no. I I, I I get this. I'm pretty sure it's it's it, the face gonna stop, but you're, you're still gonna like his stuff. That's yeah. The, it's never, that's... <coughs> yeah. It's not even about like I've always been a fan of him, but like what I mean by the phase is the phase of the fact that I really feel that freedom of like not caring anymore. Yeah, yeah. I want I want that. I want this to be permanent, like that. Not giving a shit and kind of like just approaching art the way. Fujimoto does like Fujimoto isn't, isn't drawing fan art of like fucking Naruto or Jujutsu Kaisen like posting on Instagram. This man is just like cranking out manga. Yeah. That's what I want to do. See, I'm so Fujimoto, Fujimoto is the same as uh, a lot of manga guys too. He, he's not yeah, alone. Yeah, I'm trying to be like that. that. Fuji, yeah, I'm trying to be yeah, like that. Yeah. So don't don't forget that there are other manga guys too. Fujimoto because yeah, you're comparing Fujimoto to social media artists. Fujimoto oh, is yeah. same as Kohei Orikoshi, Yusuke Murata, and Ichiro. I get that. You know. I get that. But like Kohei is like trying. You can tell like with with his art. I'm, and it's not a bad thing to try. But like he's like trying. Not he might not be trying trying, but he wants the art to be good. Like he wants mm. it to be good. I don't and know. I, this, I don't know him. I said this in my video. Yeah, I said this in my video about change uh, about uh, Tatsuki Fujimoto. And most manga artists, they want their art to be good. Like you watch a live stream of white manga drawing, he wants that shit to look good. You know what I mean? He's like trying. I think Fujimoto is like it. My I said in my video, he's not trying to impress you with his art. It just comes out that way. He kind of just draws. Like he, like I think for him, his main concern is can you tell what's going on in this panel? If yes, I'm cool with it. Like I think I think that's what he's doing. Like it's and a good I, theory. I can say the same with the with with the rest. I guess you think because yeah because bro manga is like that. Like if if. if uh, but do you know how most, many redraws Yusuke Murata does? Like, most Murata does yeah, a lot of redraws. That's specific. That's very specific. Most uh, manga artists... And Yusuke Murata too has, has a month to draw chapters. M- most artists that do one chapter a week, they don't have time to correct uh, a shit ton. Um, yeah, no, but spe- he's not... I don't, I don't think Fujimoto... You think Fujimoto yeah. is rushing? Yeah, but, but in the end, that's just... We're just assuming. Like, we don't yeah, really we know are what's assuming, happening. But like, yeah, this is all assumption. But do you think... Do you think Fujimoto is rushing? I don't think he is. I think if you want to look at someone who's rushing, it's Akutami's rushing. He's not like, not, like he's rushing. I think Fujimoto is just kind of just going. You think? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, yeah. I don't, I don't have any opinions with that. But I, all I know is that they all work in the same environment. And I, I, for me, yes, um, they, 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 they don't have the same workflow, but they think mm. differently. That's all I know. Um, yeah, yeah for you sure. Know what? 
Ko- Kohei, yeah. might, he might be trying Fujimoto is pure talent. You can say that Ichiroda is doing his thing. He like he he sleeps three hours a day, but mm-hmm. in the end, it's it's manga yeah. in a week. You know, it's one one chapter a week. Yeah. So overall, to to kind of sum it up, I want to kind of be like every I guess you said it like every manga artist and not care about social media. I just want to. Yeah, do my manga exactly. Thing. I will please, I'll still post, but like, please, I don't want please do that. To Sorry if to cut you off. Mm-hmm. Like, please, yeah, no. please do that because when you um seeing you focus on manga, is mm-hmm. more fun seeing you post like on social media. To be honest, yeah, I um, think so too. I think so too. I'm gonna focus. I'm not gonna like. I'm gonna stop doing like fan art, fan art stuff. I mean, I can I can still draw fan art every now and then, but only if <laughs> yeah. I really, really, only if I really, really want to. But I'm gonna focus on. Manga. It is cranking episodes. In, yeah, <laughs> in yeah. Real life. I think. Yeah, I think the 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 system I have right now is good, and I especially I've I've become a Discord nerd, man. Because all I do on Discord is I talk to. Well, I guess we record the podcast, and I just talk to Leah. And there's nothing. It's not really like Leah specifically, but it's so much easier for me to sketch. Like we just talk, and I'm just like sketching. sketching? And, like I'm not thinking, and like I feel like it's my best. Yeah, it's my best work. I'm just drawing random shit, whatever comes to my head, and I think that kind of makes me better. I think it's made me better a little bit, especially now that I'm drawing uh, Metal Souls now. I think it's made me better. Essentially, I just want to be like a mangaka and not care about social media at all. If I post on social media, it's like I'm posting what I'm working on. Or maybe I'm, I was sketching for fun while on Discord or something. I'm not going out of my way to be like, okay, let me draw a post that's going to get a good amount of likes so I can get followers, you know? Yeah. Like, I don't want to do that yeah, shit. Yeah, I feel, yeah. Yeah, and also on top of that, I genuinely just don't want to give a shit anymore about like anything you've seen all the comments i got on rr kind of just like reminded me like oh shit this is why i love <laughs> doing this man this yeah, is like right? you know what I mean? how many how so, many patrons you have uh 30 uh, 30 patrons 30 30 I mean, only yeah bro, only what do you mean? fuck you mean how much how many bro, you, you deserve like 100 holy shit how many do you have I got well. I got twelve this month, so I it went up from sixty to seventy-two. Damn, bro! Like I said, people will subscribe for that for the good art. I'm starting to make little, a little money, nothing too crazy, just a little bit. And yeah, I just think a, I, one bit. Ne- next year, when both of us gets like ten k a, a month, <laughs> that'd be yeah, that'd be so. nuts. <laughs> that'd be nuts. Yeah, you kind of just made me kind of just made me find, jealous, bro. I'm trying to. We can finally meet. What do you mean? Yeah, how would you? How how did you get so many? Well, you have you have more of a larger audience than me in general, but like still, you how do you have so, so I, many patrons? Patreons? Um, I so do do you know the thing where like the sketchbook thingy? Uh, before that was on my fifteen euro tier, but mm-hmm. I I put that way like down. It it's now on seven euro tier. So you can see all my sketchbook pages for seven euros. So there's like one thousand pictures of my of all of my traditional sketches, and people. Yeah. Like just went crazy. I was like, "Oh shit! Only seven euros? I mean, that's a lot. That's still a lot for me, you know." But yeah, yeah I forgot, they're like I forgot, seven, uh, seven euros worth it, and and yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot we're different. I forgot we're different artists. Like we're different type of artists. I don't think I can do the same shit you do and get the same results. Like I said, I was like I was saying, I don't think my art style's got that, you know. And I'm not saying it to bitch about it. Leah said the same shit. Like we talked about why you people like you and like RDK and even like Grand have uh are easy to, you, you just like farm <laughs> followers and shit and you guys have like you have simps she's like she was like she said i don't have simps and you don't have simps and she kind of broke it down because that chick she's looking at an eye for like art and like kind of like people's how they view that shit right she said mm-hmm. that she pretty much broke it down to like you rdk and grand your your art style kind of like communicates um not got it how like, i'm trying to say this i sound like a dick your art dude you're good as fuck your art style is not simple at all at all but like <laughs> thanks and sorry <laughs> no 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 it's not simple at all like it's good as shit like you, you obviously have skill but like what she said was um you grant and the rdk your art styles like sell people a dream you know what i mean like your art style mm-hmm. looks so good yet so simple so anybody and everybody could be like whoa this guy is so good i can like they feel like they could draw like you if they followed you and really copied you and shit like that they get to your level like fairly fairly quickly and she's like people like me people like you and because we don't have such like long like long confidence strokes and shit in our in our in our work it looks more complex and it's more discouraging to people and i'm like damn i never really saw it like that and like i was looking at rdk's art again and that man just that man probably draws with like three lines total bro 
You just, <laughs> that's okay. That's exaggeration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like exact, his style like, completely changed. Like in, yeah, yeah. Not like you guys, his style is it's obviously it's more visually appealing than mine. I'm not gonna lie, but it's more approachable. You know? uh, yeah. You know? Does that make sense? So yeah, like when she explained yeah, it that, that way, I was like, that that, that the, like the, makes it kind of clear. What I'm like thankful for for myself, actually, uh, this is me sucking my own dick. Um, mm-hmm. Is um, oh, go ahead, bro. Not, suck, suck away. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> not, not only, <laughs> not only um, I learned how to draw um, the outside of the body very attractively. Mm-hmm. I also like I also forced myself to learn what's like inside. You know the structure of the whole body to actually learn. How to draw the outside because mm-hmm. Grant Grant said it himself. He didn't study the anatomy, so he only draws. Yeah, the I saw that. Yeah, so I so I was like, oh shit, good thing I learned the inside first because now I can just deform everything and you know make something mm-hmm. good without 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 really studying the the, the hard part. But yeah, again, making manga doesn't hard. like I think it doesn't matter for like when you make a manga to learn mm-hmm. all of that shit. That's yeah, that's you don't, more need, you like don't need a, to. Yeah, that's more like school shit. Like yeah, I know the I know the inside because I've like literally memorized the entire human body because like I took anatomy classes in college and shit. But I, that's how I know the inside. But I think if you know the fundamentals, you're good, bro. You don't need to like learn the inside. You know? Yeah, I yeah, think, exactly. I look, you wish I could. I look, you wish I could suck myself off the way you do it to yourself. But I don't know, man. I <laughs> no, dude. Just... I think I think that's. I mean. <sighs> You you said it yourself. You, um, even if even if you're like um, your art style is not as you know attractive as um, mm-hmm. RDK and stuff, you still like do more than us. We just like for for yourself. Like you write because it's fun for you and that's what you want. You make mm-hmm. your own manga and the and and you, and also your fight scenes are really good. You know they're clear to to read yeah. and. And yeah, okay, bro. so you don't, you don't have to. I mean, thank you. You're making me blush, but I'm feeling like I'm an imposter right now. <laughs> no, yeah, it's, it's tough. Like, yeah, you know yeah, yeah. The, I want to be a manga like the, guy. Manga man. ka, the manga ka I met uh, here in France, they they also feel like imposter. imposter. Like, mm-hmm. I, okay, this is the thing I hate the most when I when I meet yeah. the, the manga the, the manga artists. They because they follow me on mm-hmm. Instagram, and, the, yeah. and I hate that. Oh, you're like, whoa, I just met third. And. Mm-hmm. They just say that because I have the numbers, but mm-hmm. but when I s- tell them that I meet you guys because you have you have your your own shit, like both mm-hmm. of us are different. I might yeah. have numbers on Instagram, but I don't have a published physical manga copy and mm-hmm. signing for people like you do. And yeah, they still yeah. like they're still forcing me like, oh no, you're 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 just as good as us, and like no, that's like it's completely different social. Uh, uh, social, social media, media artists media. and manga artists are completely different. Like, go, it goes back to what you said. The, yeah, it's completely yeah, different. Completely Fujimoto different. won't do what I do um, mm. because he just, you know, he loves doing what they like doing manga, like you, like the others. Yeah, that's the thing. I I love doing manga way more than the social media thing, and everybody knows that. I complain about it on my YouTube all the time. So it was <laughs> like I kind of just I kind of just had an epiphany of like, why am I trying to do both? Why don't I just do the one that I actually like and like fuck the social media aspect, you know, that's what I, that's what I'm yeah. trying to do, man. And that's why honestly, the whole situation you mes- mentioned with meeting artists, it's kind of why I hate, that's kind of like the thing that it, I kind of, it kind of pisses me off about doing art a little bit, but that shit's just stress, man. That's why I'm trying to be like Fujimoto, bro. Just fucking have fun. Don't think about any of that shit. It doesn't matter if people follow you, who gives a shit? Just have fun. That's what I'm on right now. I'm just trying to have fun. It's like, stop. I don't want to overthink who follows me and, and you know, I, who gives a shit? You yeah, know, I just I want to be the manga guy, bro. I don't. I just want to be the guy that people know. This guy makes manga, bro. This guy makes cool yeah, shit. Yeah, exactly. But at yeah. some point, I'm gonna have to settle down, and I want to make something long, bro. I want to make. I love Metal Souls, but after doing RR, it's like damn. Even if even if I left Saturday M today, I don't think I'd feel comfortable posting like the old Metal Soul chapters like publicly. I want to do redraws and shit, right? Yeah, sure. But I want I want to have a thing, man. I want to have I want to grow fan base. I'm tired of like just an Instagram fan base. I want to grow like people who are actually fans of my comics and like not me. That's what I fucking yeah. want. Yeah, like, I, I want, want you that. to, I, like when you meet me, I want you to have the the, the Metal Souls copy in your hand to talk to me. It's yeah, like, yeah, I think, yeah, I think that's, that's my quickest way of doing it. Like my quickest way of getting a book is not giving the fuck about a book. I already don't care about a book. I mean, I want, nigga, yo, if you, yo I'd take, if they, somebody gave that shit to me right now, like you would have, we can make you a book. I, hell yeah, I'm on that mm-hmm. shit. 
if but like know. i don't care about like getting one like i'm just gonna yeah 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 I, I got yeah yeah, yeah. it's yeah, like you it's not it's like it will it wouldn't change anything if you didn't get it it's just that mm-hmm. you, you it yeah it, it it would be great if you had it but it won't change uh anything mm-hmm. with your passion yeah i yeah. get that <laughs> third i was so goddamn excited man i just want to be uh i want to do manga man that's this is what I've always wanted yeah, to do. I want to. I want to do. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. You're already doing two mangas. Yeah, but I want. I want. I want like a fuck ton of chapters, and like it, yeah, it doesn't I, feel. I it doesn't feel like I'm doing it yet because Metal Souls is like, just. It feels like it almost feels like it doesn't exist because it's just behind that paywall, and not as many people are like. I don't get comments. If it's weird, we've talked about this before, but. I think, yeah, Leo, Leah, I think she texted me saying she was about to wanted to read Metal Souls because what, the way we were talking about it in the podcast and she saw that I got uh, over 100 entries on my Draw This In Your Style. And so she wanted to check it out to kind of, I guess, roast Holy me or see fuck. if it was as good. Over yeah. 100, over 100. Yeah, over 100 entries. And then she she said, I was about to, I was about to like read that shit and I saw it behind the paywall. She said, fuck that. I'm like, I know. That's pretty much what most people are probably thinking, you know? And like, yeah. who knows how much readership I'm missing out on. It sucks. Yeah, yeah, well, see, um, that's a uh, good for you that you you know what you want to do now. Because for me, I think I'm starting to be lost. I, I'm starting to, I don't know, um, what's happening right now with me. It's uh, um, it's kind of blurry. Because to be completely mm-hmm. transparent, I it's not it's not that I I don't want to draw anymore. It's just that mm-hmm. I want to do art less in my life. But I will still that's do it. I mean. you know? So no, no, that makes sense. People, oh yeah, people, people. I, I've, I've, I've been telling this to other people, but they just keep telling me, no, you should keep doing it. I just, mm-hmm. I just don't want to do anything that, like, for the followers, I guess, because I. Yeah, bro. Yeah, like, bro. I, yeah, um, because uh, my main goal before, like, before I had a uh, hundred followers, uh, one thousand mm-hmm. followers, I wanted to do a, a manga like a full one shot, but yeah. that. Yeah, but that disappeared because when I got to one K followers, um, mm-hmm. I got the numbers. The numbers fuck with you, bro. The numbers. Yeah, no, yeah. Not only that, the, there are um, opportunity. Yeah, I got the I got a shit ton of opportunities that opportunities. I, I just had to say yes. And yeah, bro, and, you gotta you gotta bob and weave that shit. You gotta know what's good for you. There's some opportunities yeah, exactly. that like might be good monetarily, but like you have to ask yourself your priorities. Like, what do I personally want? And if they don't align, you gotta weave that shit. I've gotten offers from like like names in the uh comic book industry like people who have like actual like books with like marvel and dc i can't say that shit but i've gotten emails and i should have just ignored it bro i mean i, I try not to ignore it but usually usually i like message back and be like nah i'm good i don't want to work with anybody even though like the, the money might be there maybe i get a book on a marvel thing i'm good you know i'm good yeah I'm yeah, good, yeah. But, uh, that's 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 like what i want to do now like if i get a chance sure. to work on a manga i'll do it because i just want yeah. to but you like you writing or with another writer? Do, he just no like for like right now just to force myself to draw something without writing mm-hmm. it. I can do it, but at the same time, right mm-hmm. now I'm thinking more of my manga than my than that than yeah than the, like God game because God game is like the the big thing in my life. Like without God game, mm-hmm. I, I I I won't have any income. So yeah 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 so, that's yeah. kind of it's kind of unfortunate mm-hmm. because uh i i like webtoon but it's it's really uh um webtoon, you mean like webtoon to... style or webtoon in general no webtoon in general like the format thing like making a yeah webtoon. yeah i don't it's not as personally for me it's not as fun man it's not as fun personally making a webtoon i think i think maybe you should try manga i mean you've already done webtoon. Yeah. you know how you you know how you feel yeah. about it try manga you yeah, might exactly. like it more no you see again like, like when more. when we talked about change before uh, like mm-hmm. we we when we discover something we started to like it and then it goes away mm-hmm. that's what happened to webtoon like it's been two years now and i think mm-hmm. two years is, is is a very long time to like something to be honest and yeah, webtoon yeah, yeah. is a sad thing for me but um from my like from my uh within me i think manga will be like my it, be yeah like when you when thing. you like, no, you like, find, you, you like Fujimoto, like to be permanent. Yeah. yeah, yeah, Fujimoto, like you wanting Fujimoto to be permanent, like the you know the feeling of oh I just want to yeah. be, I just want to do shits like shit like him. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's that's for that's manga for me. I just want to do manga. Every yeah, time. I think. Not I think, think it, about Instagram. I I low key want to to delete my Instagram, but I'm like, bro, I'm just gonna nah, nah, I'm just gonna waste far, far, three years yeah, of my hard work. So. Yeah, that's too far. Don't delete it. You can be like fairly 
fairly inactive. Meaning, I like, turn off my, make, I turn off my likes, dude, because I just, I just how I you just do it? I turned off my like when I was like a thousand followers. Yeah, I. So you get I, notifications every time you post something, like likes. Uh, yes, but now it's all turned off uh, now. That's nuts. The only notifications I get is from primary messages, and I'm good. I think I'm, I'm thinking about turning that off too. But then again, like this is my no, don't, don't, don't my job. Off. Yeah, don't turn yeah, that off. Yes, you, you reach out to me. Yeah, exactly. When you are coming out of all them dudes, yeah, I can't turn it off now. But somehow, like, I guess because of the draw this in your style, when people like repost the drawing and they tag me, like Instagram will notify me about it, and it's kind of annoying. I can't turn it off. Like, if I want to see the people's posts that they did for my draw this in your style, by the way, thank you for participating. If you're listening to this, uh, if I want to see it, I want to be able to just, like go on my Instagram and like scroll and find it because I am following the hashtag that I made. So like, whenever you post to the hashtag, I see it. You know. Uh, but yeah. yeah, notifications, social media is overall bad. I actually really need to quit. Well, not quit, but like I, I was doing so much better with like my social media management like three months ago. Before like my like three months ago, my screen time for Instagram was like like probably under 15 minutes a day, bro. I used to go on Instagram, post and leave. Now I actually be scrolling on scrolling and like liking shit, looking at people's stories. Mm-hmm. And I hate that shit. I hate it. And it's low-key just FOMO, like fear of missing out. Like, you know, sometimes I was like, oh, what is, what is third posting? What is, what is, uh, what is Stefan yeah. G posting? Yeah, I, I, need, I need to get over that shit, you know? And a part of me doesn't feel like offending, like, you guys, you know? Like, for example, for example, when, if you post or, like, if Stefan posts or, like, Harakami posts, I feel like after a while, if I don't repost your shit or like your shit, I feel like a dick, you know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like right now, I post stuff that I actually like, even the the shit ones, because I just you know it's just funny to me. Like sharing, um, yeah. like a video I found that's funny. Because before I was like, no, my story has to be perfect. My, <laughs> like my main page, my feed. Oh no! <laughs> now it's just bro. I don't give a fuck. I just posted a sketch. It it really truly really breaks my feed, but I don't. I just don't give a fuck. If I want well, to post, get, it, I'm gonna post it. Gives a shit. I'm looking at your feed right now. I think. I think that's what I like most about Carbon Fiber's feed. There's like this rawness to it. It's like very chaotic. You can just like post it where the fuck. And like I, I don't like it when like a feed is too organized. I don't, personally, I don't like it. And yeah, I'm just like you now. I'm posting whatever the fuck I want because I'm trying to get myself to. I need to. I need to make a word for it. To be, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna start saying Fujimoto as a verb now. To be more <laughs> yeah, Fujimoto. I, no, no. You to know? be yeah. To, to Fujimoto the shit. Uh, like to Fujimoto Fuji, yeah. something. I'm, I'm Fujimoto, Fujimoto something. Yeah, yeah, I'm Fujimotoing the uh, the Instagram. Yeah, let's <laughs> yeah, let's use that. Yeah, it's a verb. Yeah, I just like post whatever I feel like. If I like it, I'm posting it. Like not if, even if I don't like it, if I do, if I feel like like posting, I will. Like the, I've posted two sketches. I think one yesterday and one today. I I don't think I would have posted them. Like old me wouldn't have. You know. Yeah. So I just I'm just gonna do whatever I want and not care. And I'm gonna stop looking at likes. I'm gonna stop looking at my followers. I don't want to know that shit. Because that shit does affect you. And I've been looking at it lately and I hate that. Before I never like when I was when I was like on the road from like eight thousand to like ten thousand like ten thousand around that time, I never looked at that stuff. Like I, I my I had my sister, she used to check my Instagram all the time and she like messaged me when I hit a milestone. Then I'd go in, screenshot, post on my story, say thank you. I wasn't looking at that shit myself. I wasn't tracking that shit. Yeah, yeah, bro. That's what happened to me too. Like, uh, I remember when I hit fifty k, everyone's congratulating mm-hmm. me. I was like, bro, wait, what? Did I hit that? That's nuts. That's nuts that you really you're that's halfway to a hundred thousand. You're, dude, you're twenty k away from a hundred thousand. That's yeah, crazy. See, okay, see, okay. The the reason why I knew I had eighty k was when I went to the D and D thing. They were mm-hmm. because they they only they only talk to me like when when they compliment me. They they either compliment my art. Or of my 80, 80 followers, and that's mm-hmm. fucking me up. That's messing my shit up, like my head up, because um, yeah, bro, you gotta. I just, I just mm-hmm. see. Okay, once I make a manga, I'm pretty sure the eighty k, the eighty k thing will change to oh, I, I like your manga, you know. So yeah, yeah, maybe, yeah, probably, I wanna, probably, probably. I want to I wanna change that. That's, or that's maybe a good, that's a good way of thinking about it. Yeah. It might not disappear, but well, I have to accept it. Accept it. <laughs> I think, dude, this is so fucking corny. But uh, fucking, you know that whole thing <laughs> about Leo's love yourself. Here. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They, she would roast us. But like, <laughs> I think you should love yourself, bro. That oh, guy is so corny. That whole advice of like love yourself. I think Wait, that's what it, matters. What 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 what, like, what did you reference? Something, what did you reference? I, I... Like, when people say like love yourself, like that's like good advice. I think yeah, in this yeah. situation, it's like love like love your art or like like I think that's what I'm slowly starting to do. 
Like I'm starting to love my, especially after finishing RR, like the style that I have in that, I'm starting to love my art now that like, even though I get so much like more comments about how my art is mid or like how I'm, I like Diddy Mark. Uh, he's very entertaining and he's, and his YouTube videos are fun, but he's, uh, although he's not a great artist, he's still one of my favorites. And I, I, that's how that shit doesn't get to me. I'm just bobbing and weaving that shit because I get it a lot because yeah. I kind of like my art so much that it kind of doesn't matter what you tell me. I'm not going to lie and say that like negative comments don't get to me. That shit's like, yeah, she gets to me, but I'm so much, I feel like I'm getting better at handling it now because I'm starting to like love what I do. Like even if, even if I make a mistake, even if I draw something that doesn't quite look right, I'm more forgiving with myself. So like if, if someone's like complimenting you about, oh, you have 80K or like your art is good, but you rather like, you rather be complimented for having like a manga. I think if you loved what you did, like if you loved your work, that, that shit wouldn't bother you. It's like how most of my compliments are, I love your YouTube channel. Oh, you're so entertaining. I hate that shit. I hate those compliments. I mean, if you compliment me like that, I appreciate it. I know it's coming from a good place, but I hate those fucking compliments. I didn't set out to be an entertainer. I wanted to be an artist. So like, yeah. it's like, I'm the opposite of you. It's like, I guess not opposite, but like, I want to hear, oh, you're a good artist, did you, Mark? Not your YouTube is good. I hate that shit. I fucking hate <laughs> it. But nowadays it doesn't bother me because like, I like my art. If you don't like my art, if you only really like my YouTube, hey, thank you. But eh, it is what it is, you know? Yeah, I feel you. Yeah, yeah, I understand that. I understand that. Yeah, so love yourself and just accept what you did <laughs> that's basically yeah. it kind of like, kind of but accept, accept what you are basically like yeah love mm -hmm. accept what you do what you are and mm -hmm. love yourself Ugh, i'm cringing yeah, yeah. myself <laughs> but yeah love the aspects of yourself that like others may, may not love you for you know so like if i want to be loved for as an artist and even though people don't love me for that i love myself for that and that's enough so if you want to be loved as a comic creator i know you're trying i know maybe you haven't you haven't anything else yet but you are a comic creator you're trying you've uh you've gotten somewhere with um flame and silence and you're gonna make a manga soon someday i believe in you you can love that aspect of yourself even though people don't love it yet you feel me that's the thing i yeah. think that's important one day yes thanks oh but, but by the so way corny. love yourself um, <laughs> looking up um just uh just sending you the uh like the questions more uh, like i got more questions um yesterday Damn. Mm -hmm. so i'm gonna send yeah, them questions to you. is where the clickbait is you need to get like something clickbaity like yeah very clickbait i don't like how to something how like, to we can, something we can answer like the some of the like all all the um, the first batch of the questions that i sent you yeah, we can ask yeah we can answer it doesn't we don't, we don't have to specifically quick like choose questions that are clickbaity you can just have fun with it yeah. That's why I, oh, that's, why, that's why I like the chicken. I like the chicken episode, even though that one didn't do well because of the title. I, yeah, I but know, been, bro. I was so sad with that because I was so proud of that episode, and I got yeah. like the numbers fucked me up for for a day or two. But yeah, yeah. don't let that shit get to you. It looked, honestly, it at first, but I enjoyed the episode, man. I think I think it's good that we have dedicated people who will watch anything, even though we name it something goofy. Yeah, I love chicken. I know, right? I love, we have chickens or whatever. That got like 1.2k views in like a day. You know, it's not as good yeah. as the other one. But and, and it got a lot of comments too. And yeah, that's, that's I think, all. Yeah, I, I, I don't want us to like lean, like, you know, try to get clickbait all the time. I want us to be genuine. But okay, let's see. Let's <laughs> Hyper see. Owls, they asked, is it possible to become a successful digital artist if you're drawing on a phone? Oh, First of all, my... why do you want to draw on a phone? Like, why? Is it maybe that's the only thing you have? If that's the only thing to, you have, then you can, you can, you can, like, you know, you can, you can do commissions first to mm -hmm. in money and buy better shit. Don't settle on a phone. It's not worth it. It's too small for me. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I can't imagine doing that on a phone unless your phone is huge. I don't, I don't know. I can't imagine doing it on a phone. You don't, you don't need a digital, like, you don't need to do digital. Don't... Yeah, exactly. You can start off traditional because that's the easiest, um, you know, that's mm -hmm. the easiest side besides the uh, besides digital. Like you don't, and you like, don't honestly, need an expensive setup. Yeah, and honestly, if you're serious, like if you're if you're dedicated, you're getting some type of money. Whether it's like allowance from parents or or like you have a job in school, you're getting money from somewhere. Like yeah, you exactly. think like you need to save. It might take it might take literally years, but if you're serious about it, save up. Too. Yeah, part-time jobs, save up, mow lawns. If you're really, if you're really about it, if you really want to do digital art, you can make some money. You can. I'm assuming. I don't know where you are. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if you're like in Kazakhstan or some shit. Maybe I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> but you, 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 I, don't know if, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But 
you you're, you're getting money somewhere. You kind of just have to make sacrifices. Like instead of buying that new video game, how about putting that money aside for your new tablet? Hey, yep. mm-hmm, you know. Mm-hmm. This question, I have a question here by Devin Dorsey Art. What are your methods of getting commissions? I specifically chose this one third because I cannot get commissions anymore. I can't mm-hmm. even if I do, even if I want. Because DMs, how do you sift through all that shit? How do you find mm-hmm. clients through all of that? I don't know if I'm doing it wrong. Like how to like what are my process like techniques to get commissions? Like like, like I get so many DMs on Instagram that I like some of them are a lot of them are like not even asking for commissions, but like there are a good amount of them that do. And like let's say I reply or whatever. How do I keep track, bro? And like okay. you know how you uh, know how people are. Some people like see the prices and back the fuck out. And it's just a lot, yeah. it's just a lot of work. Like just yeah, to I, get I, I have an answer. I have an answer, but it's not for newer artists, it's for like experienced artists. If you had uh, old customers before, you should keep them in your in your primary uh, side, like or general anything. So when they DM you, they go uh, like directly at your DMs, not the the requests part. Uh, mm-hmm. you know? So yeah. I don't accept like new customers. I just accept new commissions from old customers. That's what I do. Wow, you get you. So you have dedicated people like that. Yeah, I mean a couple. Then again, but, then again, but, I, but I it's mostly thought, mostly yeah. mostly it's DPS. But yeah. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I wish I wish I had a, a DPS, bro. Like a YouTuber <laughs> who just like pay me to do the thumbnails. That'd be nuts. That'd be nice. I wish I it'd be yeah, so yeah. much easier if I had like three clients as opposed to like sifting through thousands. It's a Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, that that's why again I, I'm kind of thankful that I did a shit ton of commissions on mm-hmm. Twitter and now yeah. I know a bunch of people who who just, you know, who mm-hmm. who who needs artists for their work. You know the funny thing? I'm pretty sure there's there's YouTubers in my DMs, but I'm still not even fucking checking that. Like there's, yeah, there's a bunch there's YouTubers that follow me now. And I'm like, ah, they probably wanna they probably wear like and I don't check it. Not because I have anything against them. Yeah, but you I'm just, just bro, don't, I'm don't have time. Get, get, got yeah. no time for that shit. I think YouTube YouTube money, YouTube mixed with Patreon, mixed with sponsor money is good enough for me for now. I don't wanna commissions. I think I only do it if I was down bad, you know? Like maybe my cat needs to get some new medicine or some shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, so, all right. You see another question? Mm, no, it's it's just it's, there are some funny ones. It's just stupid ones. Somebody says, "Is it wrong if I ask you to invite me?" Oh, um, that's Jim. That's my assistant on God Game. I mean, you, is he good? <laughs> um, he he's he's not. Yeah, he's he's good. He wait. Well, I'm, I'm pretty spamming sure. Grand. The fuck. I, I, I'm pretty sure you're gonna say he's like a copy of me because we literally work together. But nah, yeah. nah. What is what is this thing? Is, okay, I just saw this guy. L question. <laughs> yeah. Uh, L question. Uh, let's see. You're, you're yeah, gonna say, oh this... yeah, oh yeah, he's a copy. <laughs> no, nah, I mean, I'll be honest. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. Let's see. <laughs> Bro, no, I know, I know, I know. You're gonna say, oh that. dude, oh dude, <laughs> he's a clone. <laughs> <laughs> He studied I me think, a shit ton. We talked about yeah, it. Yeah, I, I can clearly see that. It's so, but then it's not a. I'm not, but it's it's not a bad thing. Like, there's nothing wrong with studying someone, but it's just the fact that you were able to predict what I was gonna say. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah I know, bro. You said that so many times. I'm like, oh, bro, I know where it's coming. I know where it's going. Fuck that shit. I mean, you should be happy you have clones, man. I don't, I don't have clones. I mean, I I do have clones, but like, I have like three. I've seen like three people trying to draw like me. Oh shit! Um, oh, there, uh, question from Art of Mista. That's actually a good question. Uh, top three original characters by other artists that you you don't you, you don't own. Oh yeah, I saw that question. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm trying to find it so I can reread it. Art of Mifta. That you aren't your own. Fuck, I I messed that up. My bad. Somebody's name is Meat Studio. That's kind of sus, bro. <laughs> uh, what you doing, <laughs> studio, dude? <laughs> Where is this person's? I can't find it. Art Art of Mifta. That's their name. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so it's basically one? top top three OCs by other artists that aren't your own. You yeah, don't you have to find it. Lot. There's so many. Um, I'm gonna think of some because I haven't thought about this. Yeah, let me think. Let me think. Top three artists OC that are not my own. I like. Oh, hmm. That's a good. That's a good ass question. I don't. I don't really. I like. I was gonna say something mean, but I'm not gonna say it. Oh! 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 I like I like Gentora. I actually genuinely like Gentora. I do. Ah, uh, okay. Stop. No, stop. I'm not, I'm not, no I actually <laughs> like Gentora. 
I like uh I like Asuka from uh the Leah's thing. The girl with the eye with the oh, huge tits. I see, I see yeah. huge tits. Did you see yeah, that yeah, sure, did you see that sure. shit she posted today with the eye color, whatever? Yeah, that yeah, shit yeah, 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 yeah. I was geeking, That's... bro. I was like, oh my I actually want to draw that character. It's fucking sick, um, dude. I just don't know who to choose, uh, honestly, because it's so hard to think yeah, of. Yeah, they said three, right? Okay, so I said Gentora. Yeah. I said I said Asuka, and then I who's I feel like I want to say Hotaro, the guy with the blue hair, but I feel like there's somebody, some other. No, I like Stefan, Stefan, uh, Stefan Gian's also the guy with the with the mask. I think he's like oh, cool. Oh, I see. Yeah, what's his name? Do you have a name? I'm pretty sure he doesn't. Okay. He doesn't. I'm I'm not sure, bro. I have to pee. Can I can, can, be right back? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You pee a lot, bro. Go crazy. <laughs> yeah, I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate that. Okay, be right back. One eternity later. What up? I'm back. Uh, all right. What question? Oh yeah, you're supposed to think about three OCs. If you can't answer, you can move on. It's fine. Yeah, let's let's move on. Let's... Yeah, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Okay. Did you, did you did you find a a new one? A new question? A uh, question? No, I'm still looking. <sighs> I feel like a lot of these questions we've asked. Why are people asking that shit we've answered? They, someone's asking us for our top games, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> oh shit! Oh, I'm from SV Veles. I look mm -hmm. at the, the old ba the first batch, by the way. Yeah, no problem. Um, they asked, "Who do oh. you think is the most well-written protagonist slash antagonist?" So two, hmm. two, two. Best well-written. Do you want to go first, third? Uh, I you should go first because you. Yeah, I'm, you I'm know, taking, you, bro. To be honest with you. Okay, I'm gonna think too. Best um, well written, I would say, um, protagonist. I can't think of it. I, for an antagonist, I have one off the top of my head. Sasuke. Well, Sa okay. Sasuke is a. I think he's a. Isn't he a dude or rocket or some shit like that? It's not really an antagonist. I have to go to. Do. I don't know. To that's a good. That's a good. That's a good uh, choice, I guess, because I'm pretty sure Masashi Kishimoto's favorite character is Sasuke. Yeah, Sasuke is written well. People hate Sasuke, but like Sasuke was written to. Was written to perfection to in the sense hated. that, like, yeah, he yeah, he's he was written, written to be hated. hated. Yeah, exactly. Written to perfection in the sense that he served the the job that he was made for perfectly. Yeah, if if you hate him, it means he's written well. That's yeah. A... He's the deuteragonist, but I guess he can also be the antagonist as well. And deuteragonist yeah. means the secondary main character. So like Sasuke and Naruto are both main characters, but Sasuke is the secondary one. Gotcha, yeah. gotcha. Okay, okay, I didn't know that. Um, can can you yeah. can you think of like can I say uh like a, an antagonist in a series? I wanted to say Homelander. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, that's good. That's mad because, good, yo. Yeah, that's good. That's good. It's, Holy shit! How did I think of that? That's crazy. Because yeah, like when 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 you said Sasuke, it made me think of uh, Homelander. Well, I don't Homelander. Know that's yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. I'm thinking of protagonist though. I want to say. It. Bro, today's like today's um main protagonists from different mangas, they're so like the same. Yeah, there's a lot. I don't know. The same. I wanna say maybe I I can't I keep trying to think of something else, but my mind keeps rubber banding back to Aaron. Aaron Yeager. Aaron. Oh god, okay. That's a, that's yeah, that's an instant choice, but I don't want to Yeah, pick that I, that's that's why that's why I did want to pick it too, but I can't think yeah. of anything else. <laughs> God damn it. Aaron is Aaron is a good one, but I can't think I of hate it. I hate how good Attack on Titan because you can put it Yeah. Everywhere. You can put it everywhere. You can put it in all yeah. It it just does so well. Dude, what the how am I drawing a blank? Think of popular shonen or not even popular God damn it. A good a good because best well written, you know, like uh, from start to finish. Because there yeah, are there's a, there's, a, there's a lot of protagonists that I think I'm like, what the fuck? Like what is going on? Like I first God, this is gonna this is gonna get hate. I don't think I don't really fuck with Yuji Itadori as a main yeah. character. Bro, when as you said Yuji, I was like, who the fuck was that? The good thing you said no, Itadori. Yeah, Yuji Itadori. I don't know. From what I've read and seen, he, I don't I don't really know. Like, it kind of feels like, me, and I'm not a good analyst. Maybe I need to reread it. I don't, but from what I've seen, and I'm pretty caught up on the manga, it feels like shit just happens to him. I feel like... I like it when a protagonist drives the it's, story it's forward. Actually, yes, exactly. Okay, I was you about know? to say there are two types of um, protagonists for me. There's the there's mm -hmm. one who actively you know pushes the plot. Pushes the story. And, mm -hmm. Yeah, he's who's actively uh, doing something and making decisions. Also, yeah, yeah, and he's like uh, a protagonist who's also also changing other mm -hmm. like characters' uh, moral in the story. Yeah, and there are like there are other protagonists who whose moral change 
because of another one, you know, like that's um, easy, like Naruto. Like, yeah. yeah, 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 exactly. Um, that's true. <laughs> Yeah, but it feels like the know. world of JJK happens to Yuji. Like, I don't really feel him doing a lot of stuff, you know. And that's yeah, just exactly. my personal preference. I don't really like that in a protagonist. And again, that's why that's why like active protagonists are so popular. Like, think of a mm. like Luffy is not perfect at all, you know, but mm. he's fun to watch because he's all yeah. he's the one who's all like he's the main reason why this shit happens because he's yeah. Always I would actually playing. that's my answer. I would say Luffy, Luffy. And yeah. Aaron. Yeah. Luffy and Aaron, yeah, but One Piece um, isn't, isn't even my top ten, but I gotta respect Luffy for that. Luffy, God Luffy damn. will take his situation and crank it up to eleven because of the decision he makes, and he I pushes know. the story forward that way. Like, bro, Luffy, if he was, <laughs> yeah, he goes out looking for beef with these really powerful fucking people, and they don't have to do that shit at all. Like a lot of the times, Luffy goes looking for the fight, and it kind of makes the story more inter. It makes the story more interesting because the protagonist is actively making decisions. And these decisions have actions, and the actions is what like creates the conflict, and like that makes stuff interesting for me. So yeah, Luffy yeah. and Eren are my answer. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah. Okay, for sure. Um, I, I, I think I guess, bro. Can I say Naruto? Naruto is, is a good one too, but I like Naruto as a protagonist. He he has. Maybe it's biased because I, I like Naruto. I, I love, bro. You know, come on, bro. You know Naruto's my favorite anime of all time. Come on, bro. Yeah, I love Naruto. I love Naruto. I think everyone knows that here. We, yeah, Naruto's we, a good protagonist. We, I, I do be sucking One Piece and Haikyuu, and you do be sucking... Wow, uh, we switched, bro. We really switched today. I was One Piece, and you were Naruto. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Okay, see, there are different things. I, 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 like, I really like One Piece, but there are some stuff that I really like about Naruto more than One Piece. I like. Yeah. I don't. I think I'm just really biased to Naruto because it was the first thing I watched, honestly, if I was just to be honest. Okay. By the way, guys, Luffy is, is still like I still feel like Luffy is good. Mm -hmm. Okay, don't don't, don't, yeah, don't yeah. Me. You don't want to make people you you treat they they love you. You don't want them to be supported to you. But okay, um, yeah. I'm just looking at this question. Maybe laugh. This person asks, "Have you given your life to Christ?" <laughs> <laughs> Have I given my life? To Christ? <laughs> that's a that's a question I would ask to troll. That's such a me question. <laughs> I um. <laughs> I'm well, pretty sure I've how... named some of my live streams that. Like some of my live streams, I've named them. Um, let me talk to you about, about our Lord and Savior. <laughs> <laughs> our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God damn. Wow, we have a lot of stupid people. So he says Andrew Tate opinions. This this is an art podcast, bro. What the fuck? The fuck? Um, oh, cheese or chocolate? Ask. Je ne sais pas quoi mettre. That is a French name. What does that mean? I don't know what to put on his name. Oh, it's literally that's the said, name. I don't know what to put. <laughs> that's funny. Oh, man. Uh, cheese or chocolate? I'm going to say chocolate because I like sweet stuff. Okay, buddy. That could be that could be a pause, but it's okay. Oh, no. Nah, okay. That's just... That's just... That's just... Yeah, it's that's me, probably. Yeah, yeah it's that's me, just probably. creepy brain ass. <laughs> it's third... Okay, same person. It's third TikTok dead. Bro, I don't got TikTok no I saw more. That I think yeah, I want to go back on TikTok, bro. I feel like it'd be it's kind of dumb ignoring it. TikTok is the so far yeah. the future. It's think, dominating uh right yeah. now. It's completely dominating every social media. And I I don't yeah. know. I just hate I just hate comments there. I, I, oh. I think I think you're good, bro. I, I'm I was small. I never really took advantage of it. I started I started growing on TikTok and I started See, eating and I, and I quit. I, I, yeah, I took advantage of it and now I stopped because I'm like, bro, I don't need that shit. Yeah, anymore. yeah, you got you got so much clout from tic, from TikTok. I can understand you, but for me, it's like I started hitting it really early. You at least got to like what 280 followers before you started hitting it. I started hitting it really really fast. Oh no, I started hitting it at 50k, dude. I just forced. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> this is a question. I see this question from Sick Infinity. So, do you and Diddy Mark think of collaboration? To your own manga, they're asking if they want like we collaborate if we're gonna collaborate on oh, a manga. Collab. I do think you mean, that'd be like, a good idea. But who would do draw? You mean, like draw an illustration or draw a manga together? I I don't get draw it. Or a manga put, together. Like, one character, draw manga together. Hmm. It's complicated because we're both artists. Like who would write and who would draw? Yeah, exactly. Because like most most like authors who work together they they mostly disagree with their ideas that's why yeah. there's only one author in most uh if you want like if if you if really want if you wanted to work together in one story it would be a fucking movie so like we're both yeah. directors but that's i think true. on a manga it's gonna be hard to mm -hmm. write with two people it's it's better to do one author and one artist mm -hmm. two, two author it just changes the story a lot you know i think um, i i would like to do a, i would like to do a collaboration on manga uh, for an art cast like art cast thing maybe like we'll put it on patreon promote it some cool shit that can really interweave the uh 
our like cast. A, and yeah, yeah, like like a one shot exclusive. A one shot, a one shot, and like I think the way I would imagine us doing it is we would both do separate stories, but they would be connected. So you need to read both. You know oh, what I mean? You feel me? Like for example, yeah, I, I just, in just, your I, manga, I, let's say somebody's fighting and a building blew up. In my manga, it could take place in the same world, and like let's say my yeah. character is in the building, for, like and, while it's being blown up, you know. And then in the end, both of our protagonists meet, and, and me, like yeah. and, and then and then like we have to make it like both like when they both read the uh, the manga, it has to be like mm. well, like from my point of view, your yeah, character yeah. is my antagonist, and from your point of view, my character is the antagonist. We have to make it. Yeah, like yeah. That. So yeah, no the one way I imagine it is uh, the villain. Uh, did you watch the uh, Superman? Uh, what movie was it? Man of Steel, when Superman Man fought uh, Zod in the city. Uh no, I haven't. You, did, you didn't watch the DC movies? No, I I did not. Okay, fine. Did you did you watch the Hawkeye show on Disney Plus? Hawk, yes, I did. Okay, and you watched the first Avengers movie, right? Yes, I did. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, the, the yeah, beginning, episode be, one, the girl. Yeah, episode, it could be something like that where like my character maybe can be like destroying the city or some shit. Hey, maybe your character is just, like a civilian. You know, oh, suffering. Sure. Let's, so, let's that's just an that. example. Yeah, I would like oh, to do that. Yeah. I think that would that'd be fun. Let us know in the yeah. comment section if you want us to do that. That'd be interesting. Uh, okay, I just got goosebumps right there. Let's go. Yeah, let's it'd be, that'd be a crazy collab, bro. Most people collab on like an Instagram post. We did a whole two yeah, separate. Yeah, we're gonna do a whole fucking story, bro. We can't even like <laughs> print that shit out, you know? Yeah, we can. We can sell that shit. Make the make the podcast of money. Are you right. kidding? That'd be nuts. And then, Someone what do we? Asked, what, what do we even spend money on? Like, if we had, a, if we don't have a physical studio, if we made money, we just pay more editors. To be honest with you, <laughs> yeah. dude, I, I can like I can I can um, self uh, published here in France. It's it's not that hard. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you're in a nice. You're in a good country that actually values that art form. I mean, America. <laughs> America. <laughs> more America. 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 Um, all right. Do you, you, you find a question? No, I just it's someone asked Buzz does lines as desire to continue with art. You need to have passion, dude. Have fun, have passion, have fun. Yep. Um, short answer. Not, is that it? Is that it? I'm pretty sure. Wait, I haven't read the second part, the second batch. Oh, somebody says, uh, penguin underscore penguin t5 says, any thoughts on AI art? Do you want to talk about that now or you want to do a whole episode for it? Um, <laughs> I don't know, dude. Do you want to talk about it now? I don't. I don't think I have much to say for an entire episode. But like, yeah, yeah, yeah me neither. I guess we can talk about it a bit. Um, yeah, it could be possible clickbait for the title for this one. I guess. <laughs> yeah, it's mm. like at the end. It's like at yeah. the second half. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. I think AI is not a bad thing as long as it like it. Uh, AI doesn't replace real artist in the in industry like I I, yeah. bro, I I would be like pissed if if like um publishers started using ai just to publish like to create character designs you know make a movie or something um mm -hmm. i think ai could be used as a help like another tool for the artist so you, yeah. you know they can make like backgrounds easier a lot faster and mm -hmm. i was just, just about to the say process that, quicker. Okay, was, yeah, go I, ahead. I think yeah. AI art is kind of, it's kind of, I was going to say the R word. It's kind of stupid. Have you tried using <laughs> it there? It's so stupid. I, I, like, I said it. I, wait, did you, did you, you posted it on Twitter, right? Or Instagram? Yeah. God, I was fighting Shit. for my life to get that outcome. And that's not even what I had in my head. It's like you have an image in your head and AI art would not be able to like, I, I it's really, I, I want to say it's not possible, but I, it might be. But even still, it's really hard to get what you have in your head for the AI, like for the AI art to understand. It's like I typed in something and I expected something to come. Like I expected something the way the way I wanted it to look, and it gave me something else, and it was cool. But I think I would I would have rather had what I had in my head. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think I think AI can be useful. Is it gonna be? I think it's gonna be a tool for artists. So you know, background stuff like I'm drawing I'm drawing a fight in a city, and I need references for buildings. You know what I mean? I think mm -hmm. so. I don't I think agree. it's gonna replace artists at all. That special touch, that specificity. Uh, and usually when people have a project, they have a vision for it. And it's, as of right now, it's very hard to communicate uh, a vision to a robot. It'll, it'll take it very, very literally. If you told it what you want, it wouldn't like see the nuance of the vision, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah, um, I, I, I agree, actually. Uh, I don't know, man. It's, uh, 
AI. It it was kind of scary at first because they like they're so perfect they can replicate our imperfections. Because mm-hmm. I saw some of the art that an AI made, it it literally looked like a a real painting, like with oh like with errors. Yeah, I saw. Ah, mm-hmm. uh, that's uh yeah, kind of scary. Yeah. By the way, just asking questions for fun. The hell? By the way, what? Yeah, when 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 I was talking, I was scrolling, and I just wanted to show you this video I found. Like, what the fuck? Let me see. Uh, let me see. Gonna... It's on Twitter. I don't. It's really random. What's your favorite uh, thing to draw, third? What my favorite thing to draw? My characters. That's nice. Is that wait? Is that narcissist? <laughs> no, no, no. That's fine. That 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 makes sense. I guess me too. My favorite thing to draw is my characters, but I, my favorite thing to draw is manga. Oh, there's no jumper. What's happening in no jumper? Let me see. The media cannot be played. Oh, there we go. It's just fucked up, bro. Look at the uh, the dude using the bottle as a weapon, hitting the dude mm-hmm. on his head. It's kind of hurt. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Yo, did you see? Yo, look at the blood, yo, bro. I know, right? The dude could have died. Mm-hmm. Do watch too many movies. Jesus Christ, you can't do that in real life. Like, yeah, I that. know. I was so bro. I was, I was so freaked out when the the bottle literally broke. Like that's that's a hard bottle. No, no, fucking. Can't candy. Do that shit. Yeah, you can't do. Oh, my phone's ringing. You can't do that shit in real life, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah. In movies, oh. in movies, the bottle just breaks and nothing. In real life, that shit, dudes will bleed. Dude. <laughs> the yeah, I <laughs> well, I'm yeah, still well, watching it. Never mind. Uh, just uh, we just. I just show. Wow, this is why I don't. This is why I don't go to parties, man. People are wild. It's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. It's Alex 2.0 as Andrew Tate opinions. <laughs> uh, God damn. Nah, it. I'm not gonna say my opinions. I'm not gonna say my opinions. I have my opinions, but I'm not gonna say it. I cannot cannot talk about a sexist guy. Uh, there you go. That's your opinion right there. <laughs> yeah, I cannot talk about a sexist guy. I just think. Uh, I just think he's being. He's trying he's to be memeing. funny. I'm pretty sure he's I, memeing. I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, I, think he's, I think he's just trying to be funny, you know? And like, yeah. he's, he's, he wants to purposely get a reaction out of people and people are just giving him what he wants. That's what I yeah, think. Yeah, exactly. There was this, okay, there was this one dude um, because uh, I, ha- I had a, a follower who really likes my stuff and he started, mm-hmm. like, he's starting um, posting about Andrew Tate, why, like, how he likes him. And then mm-hmm. another follower of mine was like, hey, dude, can you, can you, talk to this follower of yours like he likes Andrew Tate and he's not a good fuck. thing I was like bro I don't give a fuck you know like yeah he, I don't really care yeah, too yeah he 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 if he likes him then do his thing like for sure I, uh, he draws good I, I respect his art but I don't really care mm-hmm. what he do what he he does personally just yeah. and also um, Andrew Tate when you when you watch his stuff like I've seen a mm-hmm. lot of his stuff and Bro, he's like so satire with his stuff. Like, yeah, I'm pretty sure he's saying. Have you heard some of the shit he says? Yeah, bro, it's not. I'm pretty sure he's not believe. He doesn't believe any of his of his like shit. He only he says, says it to shit, piece of people. Yeah, yeah. I, I heard him say. I heard him say. I'm one of God's favorites. I have five Bugattis. I have seven <laughs> supercars. And it's like, yeah. dude, this man said he's one of God's favorites. I'm like, the fact that y'all are still taking him seriously is funny to me. Yeah. Um. But uh, I don't really care now, about. I, I hate politics or anything political. I don't, I don't now, care about that shit. Yeah, he's yeah. bad right. He's bad right now. But that's all I see about that. Don't want to speak too much about that shit. Uh, I guess serious. let's let's pat it out just a little bit. Not too long. I got people calling me. I got shit to do. Um, yeah, but yeah, for sure. Let's talk I mean, about can... like future plans a little bit. Like it's not gonna take long. Future yeah. plans. Um... Yeah, like what? Like you know, kind of anything that you might want to do. Nothing's concrete. Like whoever's listening, this is not like concrete. It's just stuff that we would like to do. Yeah. Just okay. in the next year or something. Like we would just like to. Like we can just daydream a little bit and maybe, you know, after the, in a year, we can come back and listen to this and see how much stuff we actually got done. It might be fun. Uh yeah, for please sure. join us uh, in the comment section. We want to know what you guys' plans are as well. Because we're mm. artists, we like projects. So you want to go first? Yeah, I have a plan like for the rest of the this month, like uh on mm-hmm. October, November, December. My like uh with a a good friend of mine, Hatesoru, we're gonna mm-hmm. we're gonna see um, a concert like a Miyazaki uh, um, 
concert. Bro, you, a whole, like, you a whole art nerd, bro. You go to a Miyazaki concert, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they, they love Miyazaki. They're a big fan of Miyazaki and, you know, uh, mm-hmm. Studio Ghibli. So mm-hmm. we're going to see that together uh, next month, and that's going to be fun. Um, mm-hmm. Like, my future plans not going to be about art, I'm pretty sure, because I, I want to focus good, just about it. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah, so, sorry and not sorry, guys. I'm not going to post a shit ton on Instagram. Um, yeah, yeah, me neither. Me neither. Yeah, I mean, if I post a shit ton, it's gonna be like do, like sketches that I'm just trying to like. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fun. I think I I, yeah. I do the same. And it's yeah, not gonna I be think... anything polished. It's gonna be fun, man. Like, I'm just I just wanna have fun. Facts. That's it. Just yeah. Have fun. Yeah. Same. You know? Same. Okay. So, like, final um resp- uh, answer, I guess, is I just wanna meet more people because. Um, like, like during the past few weeks, I've met a a ton of people and it's actually Mm -hmm. fun talking to them. Like, like, it's actually fun. Yeah, I know, right? It's fun. It's fun talking. (laughs) Like introvert like me talking. That's, that, that, that seems impossible. That's wild, bro. That's crazy. It's possible. I might not talk a lot, but I, like my presence there is enough. You know, I just want to, I just want people, uh, talking around me. (laughs) That's That's nice. That's nice. (laughs) <laughs> yeah no, I, I get that i get that but um do yeah, you have i any... want to go out more mm-hmm. do i have any that's, that's no that's a good that's a good go out more i want to live life more what that means is i want to do stuff that i want to do so like do i want to go to parties and talk to people more no i'm like so i'm not gonna do it but um i want to be able to just do shit that i've always wanted to do and i guess we'll come back to me because i haven't finished with you i just want to ask you some stuff third like in oh, the yeah. next, like, so you just talked about the next few months up until December. What about the next year? Like, talk to me about projects wise. I know you're not going to be on Instagram or whatever, whatever. But oh, like, like, do you want to, like, what projects like, do you want to work on? If any at all, you don't have to, bro. You can take a whole year and just have fun. I think you know, I really have a new philosophy on life, bro. We have, sometimes it's very hard to understand these people. Listen, I'm about to deep throw up my mic, man. Listen, listen. <laughs> we have one life, motherfuckers. We have, yes. you know, the, you know, you know, the craziest shit. They like some people don't like some people are not gonna wake up tomorrow and they have no idea. That's fucking crazy. We can die at any moment. God, this is dark. But we have one life. Enjoy yeah. it, bro. If you have a job that you hate and you're young and you don't really have responsibilities like that, get out of that shit. Live your yeah. life. Don't sell your soul. Don't sell your time to somebody else because that's the most precious shit on this planet. Have fun. Do what you love and fuck people if they don't fuck with you. Um, so yeah, third, let me hear, let me hear about your projects. If you don't want to do any, I'm, I fully support with you. I fully support you, bro. Okay. Um, so like, um, from outside family, I just like for my own projects and like just Mm -hmm. talking about me, Mm -hmm. I want to, uh, get a stand on the Japanese exposition next summer to, you know, to, to have my own stand, to sell my shit. I want to have like a, like a copy of like some of my one shot, maybe just a one shot. Mm-hmm. Uh, I that's, want to make a beautiful. manga. So basically, uh, having a stand there and making mm-hmm. a a one shot at the same time, and mm-hmm. one shot stand maybe uh, being an original or on a on a publishing company. I don't know. Just you know. No, uh, that's beautiful, bro. You're in France, bro. Like, <laughs> I would I would give my toenail and like my cat. Okay, that's a joke. <laughs> I love him, but I'd give my toes, bro, to be in a situation where. You have a chance, right? I don't think I think Tony Valente is really like the only French artist to really do the whole Japanese experience, whatever. But it's that's hope. That's something for you. The, the, we don't have that in the West at all. Yeah. You feel me? We yeah. don't have that. So, uh, but th- that's, but still, yeah, that's, that's still that's still that shouldn't let any Western artists like that shouldn't make you stop dreaming. But still, you know. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Now I want to know about your future stuff. You might have some stuff that you want to mm-hmm. you know announce yeah. to everyone. Yeah, so when it comes to like life, not like non-art related, I just wanna, I just wanna, I don't want regrets, man. So like, if there's something that I really wanna do, I'm gonna do it. Uh, right now, what I really wanna do is I wanna give, bro. I wish I, I, I wish I had money, bro. I wanna give my girl the world because she deserves that shit. When you do what I do, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying. You, you drop this. Solid, <laughs> you drop uh, this. Yeah, <laughs> you need a solid support fan base. And so if you call me simp. In the comments, go fuck yourself. This girl's yeah, been with fuck me for yourself. Years. Fuck yeah, yourself. She's, she's been with me for three years. She's <laughs> right. Or, hey. She's right or die if I've ever heard of it. Like she was there, my like when I was down. She helped me out. She believed in me when nobody else did. So I've always wanted to go to Hawaii. So I want to take her to Hawaii. Uh, Good for you, my man. That's yeah. sweet. Yeah, I'm saving up for that. We're gonna do that. Uh, I want to do that before the end of next year. 
Um, so that's life stuff. So that on top of like just have fun. So to be honest with you, having fun to me is pretty much drawing. So I guess I'll just be drawing more. But, yeah, exactly. <laughs> but, but you I know, think, yeah, I think yeah. Um, I, it's mm. the same for me as going out, I guess. I just yeah. want to experience life. I, I, yeah, I missed all that for, for the past 18 years. Yeah, grind set, grind set mindset is good. It isn't like we're, we're at a, we're an age where we should be grinding, yes. But, we, mm. you know, we have to stop to uh, enjoy life at the same time. We can't just be, you know, dying from stress because we're overworking. I personally, there's like an honor in feeling overworked. I feel like I feel a little accomplished. That might be toxic, but sue me, whatever. That's life. <laughs> when it yeah. comes to art, when it comes to art, before the end of this year, before December, I want to have... Um, at least three chapters of Metal Souls like finished. So like I'm right now, I'm currently working on chapter five. So I want to have at least chapter seven done before December ends. And I think that's very reasonable. Um, I want to have- That's highly chapter... reasonable. Especially yeah. in your schedule. <clears throat> exactly. I want to have chapter two of RR also done before the end of this year. Maybe three, no promises. I think I really want to break into the, uh, like the Japanese manga scene. I think- I think I've been afraid and I am still very, very, very afraid. And that's okay. But yeah, I think I want to actually aim for um Japan publishing. Like uh no, like like I'm I'm not I don't really know if manga plus like manga plus is still new. I'm not really banking on that shit. But everything that happened kind of like kind of just opened my eyes that they are looking, you know, for foreign talent, you feel me? So Yeah. I think it's worth trying. So that's I, you know that's a good ass goal, and that's a that's actually mm -hmm. a, a possible goal from what we've seen before. Um, yeah, Boichi, yeah. You know, gets that is true. Here. That is true. I don't speak a lick of Japanese. I don't plan on learning any, but uh, I'm, I'm gonna aim for it. As long as I, as long as you're good, you're you're good. Yeah, I just want to make a whole lot of manga. Like ideally, I want to be dropping a chapter or one shot a month, like for every single month. It's gonna be. Yes. Yes, sir. And like, I want, I have a, I want to make another one shot. I want to say before the year ends, but I really want to get to chapter 10 of Metal. I really want Metal Souls to get to the 10th chapter because that's when the prologue, at least in my eyes, would have ended. And that's, I think that's when people would like be really, really hyped on the series. Like if they're, if they read it, if they can read it, you know what I mean? Yeah. But that's like, that's, 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 uh, that's ex actually exciting. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can't wait. Yeah. <clears throat> so yeah. If so, Metal Souls, I want to, I want to work on Metal Souls and I want to work on RR. And I know I want to, yeah, go out. I don't know if RR is going to help me with that whole Japan Akik publishing goal type thing. Oh, I don't know. No, I, think, I think it could, I think it will help you to be you honest. Think? Yeah. I yeah. Just, yeah. Like, I don't know. I feel like I'm held back by the whole like, uh, right to left thing, left to right thing that I do. And I think because like the whole, the reading orientation thing is very gay, like very gay. Kid. I think it doesn't matter. I personally don't think it doesn't matter at all, but like, the community is so like if it's not the read right well if not the right reading orientation it's not real you know that shit kind of looky gets to me to be honest with you even yeah, though i think it doesn't see, matter those people are just kind of stupid and they just don't yeah. want to accept like, it's like being racist in in, in my yeah exactly it's like yeah. oh yeah no you, you're like that you know it's, it's like it's pe bro people still think that like mm -hmm. dr stone is not a manga you know because boy really? did it yeah, yeah for sure stupid. okay that's that's re that's retard uh yeah that that's yeah, stupid yeah. they are very that's stupid so dumb that's so dumb but yeah okay so metal souls is my saturday m thing and i guess rr is gonna be my hustle man like my like my a i'm gonna use that to really aim to be a air quote popular mangaka yeah you're gonna popular, i don't mean yeah i'm gonna fujimoto that shit yeah you said it's a verb but but <laughs> my, i want to be a popular mangaka not like as popular as like Kohei and shit like that. I just want to be like decently well known. Like to where like if I had a subreddit, there'd be like two thousand people in there. You feel me? So nothing crazy. You know? That's that. Hey, that's lucky crazy. Two <laughs> K in the red so in the Reddit. Okay, like, fine. Let me let me let me like three hundred. <laughs> let me like three hundred. Let me like three hundred. Like no, I okay. Um, to be honest, yeah, I, that's that's fair. But I don't think it will never be enough. So. Mm -hmm. I I get what I get your goal though. Like to be like known enough to the point where you're like ah. Oh, like if I stop now, I don't just really care. Yeah, um, yeah. I I, I want to be known. I, and I use um Dog Ningen as an example. Like how that's kind of known. There's like a lot of YouTube videos about it. Like the YouTube videos that have like hundreds of thousands of views talking about that manga, and it's made by a black guy. You feel me? 
Like, yeah. but it's still, it's still air quote underground. It's like an underground manga. Like they're not as big as Fujimoto or any other Japanese guy. That's like the level I want to get to, to where yeah. I'm sort of like, you, you know, you want that to level have, thing. Yeah. You want to have a manga that hits like people to, like to mm-hmm. the point where they talk about it in publicly. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's what I want to do for the, with RR yeah, specifically. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I think I feel like I'm talking too much. There's something else I'm forgetting. Oh yeah. My yeah, next thing. My next thing would be, it's going to be a one shot probably. And it's probably not going to be a series unless it does stupidly well. And I don't, I don't know <laughs> if it will, but um, it's going to be car. It's going to be called car baby. Uh, car baby. Oh yeah. 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 You talked about, yeah. the, you talked about the, 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 the plot about that. Yeah. Yeah. Some chick sleeps. She has a fetish for cars. She fucks one that she gives birth to a half. Yeah. Give birth to a half human, half car. It's going to be badass. Because, because you know how you kind of had that discovery of no more doing study sheets. You know me that I told you a while ago, I'm, I've been done doing that for like two months now. I'm yeah. no longer just studying. I'm just like making stuff. And one thing I've, I've learned about with doing RR is a lot of the comments are like, dude, your writing is so good. Your writing has gotten better. And as I was writing RR, while I was writing the script, I was like thinking, damn, my writing is getting better. So I think the more content I produce, the better I get at writing. And I really want to get fucking good at writing. Yeah, uh, for sure. You read RR and I think you play, I think you, you know, you might, you probably like it. I think so. I hope so. Mm-hmm. And uh, you notice the improvement in writing. And I think I want to keep, yeah, every now and then I think I'm maybe want to do a one shot to improve my writing. Uh, not necessarily art. So Car Baby, I would like that one shot to come out before the end of this year. But like I said, I want to focus on Metal Souls this year. I want to get to chapter 10 ASAP. I think after I hit chapter 10 of Metal Souls, I'll probably chill out with it a little. A little. And, uh, mm-hmm. I think it's nice. also it also helps in my advantage that um that what's it called that saturday i'm is going to slow down next year like they're not going to be releasing monthly anymore i think it's gonna be like every three or four months or some crazy shit so you know that's yeah. gonna be a breeze it's gonna be a breeze for me so i'm gonna yeah. focus on i'm gonna focus on rr and um my one shots and then metal soul so yeah those are my that's, plans i talk too much that's an awesome plan no 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 that's yeah. that's very good well, uh, right. sorry guys for this uh, very short. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a short yeah, it's, it's two podcast. Hours. It's not, I don't think it's short. Oh, two hours. Okay, <laughs> yeah, we well, hit, that's we perfect then. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's go. Okay, shit. Let's go. Well, um, this has been the uh, tenth episode of the Artcast podcast. Thank you guys for mm-hmm. um watching and oh yeah, follow us on Patreon because we yes, have to the Patreon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. If, you, if you if you want to um get your que- questions answered every time, just ask us there. You know. Yeah. Um, we all, and we, we get the episodes like a week early. Yeah. Yes. You and, to, that's true. And also, if you want the exclusive um part of the uh the podcast, because we do cut some. Yeah, we stuff cut out, out like forty minutes, thirty minutes. We cut out a lot. So if you want yeah. like the part that we cut out, the shit that we think gets us canceled, if you want to hear that stuff. You can you can sub to the Patreon, but promise not to talk about it in public. Don't snitch, you know. Don't get us canceled. Yes, well, yes, yeah. yes. Please, please do, please do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you guys. Um, see you guys on the next season, I guess. Yes, sir. Bye. W season one in the chat or in the comments, whatever. Yeah. All right. Bye. Bye. bye.